Hello, this is Heisenberg with breaking news. The Hanna-Barbera Godzilla statue goes on pre-order from Mondo on August 17th, 2021. Yeah, it's just a few days from now. And we're going to zoom in. We've got new high-definition photos provided by Mondo. And we're going to zoom in, look, get a very good close look at it. So, yes, the statue is based on the 1978 Hanna-Barbera Godzilla cartoon. It's part of Mondo's Godzilla Museum series of statues. And actually, this is the first, the very first statue in the series. So it's seven and a half inches tall, and it comes with a base. So with the base, it's eight and one quarter inches tall. And we're going to zoom in on the base, don't worry. And let's see, I believe, I believe this is the very first Godzilla cartoon figure that's ever been made. So from this you know, Godzilla 1978 cartoon. This is the first figure that's ever been made of it, at least uh, the first official one. And it's a limited edition. Limited to how many? Uh, they didn't say. Mondo has not said uh, how many of these they're going to make. My, one possibility is, so they actually go on sale, or at least the plan. The plan is that they're going to go on sale around March or April of 2022. Though who knows what will really happen, you know, in, the, in this day and age. You know, lots of things, lots of things could come up. But yeah, so the plan is to actually ship them out around March or, or April of 2022. So one possibility is that they're sort of going to wait and see how many people pre-order it and then maybe adjust how many they make based on that. So I don't think it's going to be a very small number like 100. If it was a small number like 100, I think they would have said said so. So, so I don't think we have to worry about it selling out within the first few seconds. Uh, one possibility is that there won't be any problem with it selling out at all. But, uh, but another possibility is it will, might sell out fast. I don't think it'll sell out within seconds. Will it sell, sell out in the first 10 minutes? Probably not, but maybe. Sell out in the first hour or the first day? Yeah, again, these are possibilities. So if you want one, I would uh, make a point of ordering it when it goes on sale, or when it goes up for pre-order, which, again, is August 17th. And they didn't say what time of day. My guess is it would be around uh, sometime in the middle of the day. They have an email list. You could get on, you could sign up for their mailing list, and they're pretty good about mailing, sending out an email like the day before something goes on sale with the details. All right, so like I said, limited edition. We don't know how many they're going to make, though, but it sells for $120.00. It's made of vinyl and PVC, and I believe there's no articulation. They didn't explicitly say, I don't think, that there's no articulation. But looking at it, I would, I would guess, I would, it very much looks like there's no articulation. I mean, that's, you know, especially since they're calling it a statue and it doesn't look like it has any. So I don't expect any articulation. All right. So like I said, this is very, very exciting. There's, yeah, there's the base, you know, clearly labeled. Very exciting for this whole uh, Godzilla Museum series from Mondo. There's a lot of, uh, looks like uh, they're going to do a variety of items, and uh, they've announced the first uh, three. Again, they're also going to do 1954 Godzilla, and uh, a Godzilla based on uh, the artwork of Attack Peter. So, and then, you know, there'll be more more after that, which has not been announced yet. So, yeah, lots of good stuff. Got lots of good stuff to look forward to. All right, this is Heisenberg, hoping you enjoy your Hanna-Barbera Godzilla statue.